Hi guys, welcome back to another video of Beginner's Makeup Week. Today we are at episode number 4 and we are going to learn how to perfect that winged eyeliner. So winged eyeliner is a makeup skill that everybody loves to have like after their makeup bag because it's a very quick on the go makeup thing you know you even when you don't apply full face makeup you want to have a nice sharp eyeliner and go out of the house and winged eyeliner is something that can go terribly wrong like it's so difficult to get them even and get them like balanced out and for them to look proper and to define your eye shape there's so much that goes into it and it's really a skill that comes with a lot of practice and i'm personally speaking with experience so even though you're watching this video now i urge you to watch it and practice along with me while I apply on your screens right now you can go ahead and take your eyeliner and apply with me so that you're learning the steps as you go and you'll really have to like practice them to master them so before you dive into this video if you've not subscribed to my channel then please make sure that you do I've done an entire week where I've dedicated it to beginner makeup tutorials so I'm going to leave the links to those videos in the description section you can go check them out and also subscribe to my channel because I'm still uploading more videos in these series and I upload twice every week so hit that subscribe button hit the bell icon right next to it and then you can keep on watching Already I apologize from before that you have to look at my face from such a zoomed in lens but uh, if you really want to learn how to get a winged liner this is the lens that I have to use. I'm going to teach you how to do a winged eyeliner with a liquid eyeliner. This is a liquid eyeliner I love to use. It is the Lacme Absolute Shine Line Eyeliner and it is in the shade black. So it has this brush uh, which has a very very tiny felt tip. If you learn how to apply with this, you can apply with any other eyeliner. You can apply with a gel uh, pot and a brush. You can apply with a felt tip eyeliner, whatever works for you. Just the technique is what you have to keep in mind when you're doing your winged eyeliner the next time. Okay, so to start with, you need to know where you want your wing to go. So for that, just take a brush or a pencil or any like a kajal pencil or a brow product or something and just place it like near your nose angle it like this so you know where you want your wing to flick so this line is meeting my nose it's meeting the edge of my eye and it's meeting the eyebrow so this is exactly where you want it to go so now you need to mark this point so taking a little bit of the liquid liner just be very very careful wing liner is all about technique precision and practice so just mark this area okay I've created a dot so that is how I want my wing liner to angulate the same thing I'll be doing on the opposite side but first let's create this wing liner so now that I know how my wing liner should go we will directly start with applying it keep your pinky finger rested on your face you want your pinky finger to rest on your face and this is how you'll hold your wrist is down your fingers are on top your pinky finger can rest on your face and you will take from the base of your lower lower lash not from the base of your upper lash from the base of your lower lash you will start your eyeliner now the crucial thing is how much pressure you apply so the most pressure you should apply is at the base and then on top you just flick okay so I'll show you you keep it here Put pressure and then flick it. Do you see that? I just put pressure at the base and I flipped it. So I have my first line ready right here. Okay, so now that we have this line, how do we join it to our eye? For that, you will not go from the tip. Up your line ban gaye, uske tip se nahi jana hai. You have to go a little below that. So that top portion is like a flick. You don't want to start from that flick. If you start from that flick, it will look very like very bold and bulky you want it smooth soft edge to your winged eyeliner so you will leave that top part as is water part leave on top and then start with skinny chisel okay so did you see that i started quarter portion there and then i joined it to my lash now you can take a little more product on your brush and first just fill in this wing so just carefully have to fill the wing in 
since we left the top portion it's a nice and smooth flick on top okay so now that we have the wing and the flick going on we just want to join the line on the inside so while taking that top line only we came obliquely downwards so that we wanted to join to the lash line now you just want to go over your lash line so that is depending on how much thickness you want since i have no eyeshadow going on i can go in for a thick eyeliner if i had a nice eyeshadow look i would go in for a slim eyeliner so that my eyeshadow really shows now i have hooded eyes so this also depends on the eye shape you have once again with eyeliner don't take too much product when you're like taking your eyeliner just remove all the excess on the bottle itself you need the minimal product to just sketch out and then you can fill in so going from the inside inner corner and just joining it and then close your eyes and see if it's nice and smooth if it's not you can like Okay, so this is the winged eyeliner all complete. Now the main thing is to get these two to match. So for that, that main step that we did matters a lot because like your nose and your eye and your eyebrow are not going to change place. Your face is fairly symmetrical. Once again, do the same thing. Take the brush, keep it on your nose, rest it on your nose. It's meeting your eyebrow and it's meeting your eye. And then poke it wherever you get the brush. So some rough poking has happened. Okay, I have a rough idea where I need my eyeliner to go. You can do that with a kajal, you can do that with anything because you're going to fill in that area with the winged eyeliner. Okay, so now if you can see there's a big big mistake that has happened here which is not over here while marking I went a little ara so I have like a line which is sprouting from my wing so now for that I can correct either with a concealer or with my makeup remover now if you have full eye makeup going on that can be a bummer and like it will like really cost you because you'll have to do a lot of mixing and blending but right now I have no eye makeup going on so I can easily correct this mistake and since you are a beginner and you will be practicing this mistakes are about to happen so I am going to correct this and show you how I do it so take a q-tip and take a little bit of your makeup remover and just drench your q-tip in that you don't need too much makeup remover otherwise you will end up removing what you have going on also so just flatten the q-tip remove the excess makeup remover and just have to precisely go in the area that you have made the mistake and not remove the entire eyeliner so really carefully go there and sharpen the wing and we're done and with the other side of the q-tip which is having no product on you can just clean up you can clean your winged eyeliner even from below if you've made any mistakes cleaning up really gives you the precision you need you can also take a concealer and define your eyeliner if you want to do that so I'm just taking a little bit of concealer under both my eyelids I'm just going to define it with my fingers So that I have a very clean and nice looking wing, a very sharp wing. Okay, now I feel this looks a little thinner over here as compared to this, like this is looking more thick. So all you have to do is take more product and match. That's why I say take little little at a time 
so you can always keep matching the wings look fine to me like the length of the wing and the angle in which it's going is perfect the thickness is what varies so we can just make this a little more thicker okay i think now i'm very satisfied with my winged eyeliner and this is our winged eyeliner tutorial all complete Okay, so we are done with the winged eyeliner tutorial. This completes episode number four for the beginner makeup series. I kept this one very simple and to the point and just showed you all the technique with liquid eyeliner. But you can duplicate the exact same thing with a felt tip eyeliner. Just that you won't be able to get a winged eyeliner with a kajal. You can do the same thing with a gel eyeliner or a felt tip eyeliner. You just have to get the techniques right. So I hope you guys enjoyed, found this video helpful. If you did, then don't forget to hit the like button. Check out the other beginner makeup series videos. I'm going to leave that playlist in the description section so you can go check it out there. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, then please make sure that you do. Click on that big red subscribe button down below and join this beautiful family and also click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified every time I upload a new video. I will see you guys in my next video tomorrow for probably the last episode of the beginner's makeup series. Bye guys, love you all. Mwah.